And look at that. 347 gunboat energy on the Mega Crab Stage 8. That's pretty impressive, guys. Hello guys, this is Bull Cable back with another video and the Mega Crab has landed and I'm super excited to get stuck in straight away. So basically we're going to be boosting up as many statues as possible, so we'll boost up absolutely everything and this is going to be really good and we're going to be getting a lot of resources as well um, because you can actually get through quite a lot of the stages of the Mega Crab with actually no bother at all, um, especially when you're a high level like me. So we're going to be boosting up every sort of defense there. I don't know if the... I'm just going to... May as well do the Power Stone chance as well anyway. So here we go, stage one of the Mega Crab. I'm using Tank Medics. As I said, let's get straight in and see what happens here. So, oh my goodness. This is the brand new thing. I think it speeds things up. I actually predicted this in the last video. I predicted that this would actually be a speed up tool. So we'll just use artillery here, um, then our speed up there. It's going to critter everything. There's so many critters. And we're going to take this base down anyway. So that's that base taken down. Stage 1 obviously designed for a lot lower level players. It's super, super easy to take down. Probably easier than stage 1 of uh, Dr. T. So we'll basically take this out, stage 2, straight away. Let's see if we can get stuck in here again. So we'll place the troops. I think we could see if we can just take it down with artillery. We'll do two barrages. Yeah, this will be able to get taken down with artillery. We'll finish this one off as well. Um, super, super easy. In fact, we'll probably go as far as we possibly can um, and see how far we can get with just using artillery to start off with. And then we'll obviously lay the troops and then find out what we can do after that. So, stage 3, here we go. I'll just lay one artillery first to check if it's actually possible. One artillery. Stage 3 is very similar to stage 1, yes. This will be able to be finished with barrages and stuff, so there's stage 3 done as well. My goodness, we're ripping through this. Probably aim is to maybe get to about stage 15 in this video, and then I'll be doing another video of the next one. Because this video will be pretty long, me taking down stages of the Mega Crab. Um, I think I did a video last time on this, it's obviously the version 3 of Mega Crab. There has been two previous versions if you guys are new to this. And every time they've added something new, the first time they added the Critter Boxes, which I'm, which is these right here. And then the next time they added Cryo Bombs, which freeze the place, which are actually not on this map at the moment. But they'll, they'll, they'll appear guys, and I've obviously added this brand new speed um, thing in as well, which is really, really cool. And we'll just take that down with artillery as well. So, yeah, this is going to be pretty good. I want to see how far we can get. I'm not going for the leaderboards. You need to be playing it quite a lot. and You need to be very good as well. Um, I'm not really up to scratch at the moment. I've actually been not playing this game very much at the moment. But I'm going to be trying to get back into it for you guys. Because I'm enjoying the game back again. And we're going to be trying to get some more content for you guys. So remember to subscribe to this channel for more Boom Beach videos. Obviously, I'll be doing Clash Royale videos as well. Uh, I do enjoy doing that. So, yeah. So we've got the basically a Boom Beach and Clash Royale channel here. And... We'll just be having fun, taking things out, and um, doing updates, sneak peeks, all that kind of thing. So yeah, if you want to stay tuned, just subscribe to the channel. So obviously stage 5 is, is going to be a breeze, guys. These critters look really cool. Oh, these critters look smart with a brand new speed boost. And they're just going to be burning through this, taking all of the mines out while they run. And it lets my tanks just roll up like a boss. Look at this, the tanks are just rolling up. These critters are just taking out all the mines. We've got so much... Um, um, there's the cryo bomb here. I wonder if the cryo bomb activates the speeds as well. So we'll just find that out. Cryo bomb goes away, bang, and it doesn't take the these things out, but it does damage them. That's that's something to take into consideration. So I'm going to be activating these speeds now. Does one speed activate another? Let's see if it does. So bang, it does not. So we have to take that in mind as well, which is really really cool. So obviously we're going to get a little bit harder now. What stage are we on? We're on stage 6. So I said stage 15. Obviously these are boosted. I've got more gumbo energy than I probably will. And it will definitely more than I do normally. So we'll see what this is. We're going to take out that um, them 
shield generators. Probably shouldn't do that. I could probably just take them out with the tanks anyway. So that's them out. Let's go down the beach. So we'll start at the right hand side here. Um, just going to put one critter box over this. Actually, I could probably blow that up. Ah, oh, my goodness. I'm wasting critters to blow them up, but actually these blow themselves up, which is pretty cool. Um, yeah, this is quite smart. You have to be tactical. Does the... Yeah, the the speed boost counters the cryobomb. So you want to deploy the cryobomb first to freeze the, the defenses. Remember, actually, this is quite hard because the speed boost can also speed up the attack speed of the defenses. You have to be pretty careful what you're doing here. And um, obviously it will speed up your your actual troops as well. So you have to really need to watch out about this and uh, maybe some later stages it will get a little bit harder. So yeah, we need to watch out for that. Anyway, we're just kind of burning through these bases. It's super, super easy at the moment. Obviously it's um, a pretty early stage. Uh, the, the medics do a great job at sustaining the health of the tanks. They actually do an amazing job. Look at the gunboat energy, guys. Look at this gunboat energy. Oh my goodness. Um, in fact, I might try and attempt to get some of the most gunboat energy in the entire game. Obviously, if I had more gunboat energy statues, this would be easier. But I'm going to try and take down the next Mega Crab stage without using any Gumbo Energy. So this will mean, I, may, I maybe use one or two just to keep them alive. But we'll try and see how much we can get here. So, um, oh, this is not a good enough uh, map. We'll do it on the next one because it's just a straight base here. So we'll just go straight through the middle. In fact, we could probably just go straight for this. I'm going to barrage here and here. Um... And then we'll artillery this here. And then we're just going to be critter, critter, critter. Um, and then critter on the base as well. Two critter boxes on the base. And this will most definitely, three critter boxes on the base. This is going to be a critter. This is going to be insane critters on the base. And that's that base taken out. So that's stage seven taken out pretty easily there. Quite good. The critters are... They actually design these bases pretty well. These are not randomized bases, I don't think. I'm just going to say that right now. I don't think the starts are randomized bases because they've obviously placed some of these boxes in in deliberate places. Um, but anyway, oh, we actually got a lot of gold now, so we'll probably upgrade our. Actually, I'm going to wait till we can upgrade our maxed uh, grenaders. I want to get some maxed grenade gameplay for you guys. So that's we'll just wait for that one, and then we'll just see. Oh, this is going to be an absolute perfect one for for this. So we'll just leave the troops go. Now, all we need to do now is really nothing. <laughs> all we do is wait it out and see um, how much gunboat energy we can actually achieve here. So I wonder if I will skip this. Probably not. So we'll just wait it out and... Basically, let me know your guys' opinion on the Mega Craft. Obviously, it's super fun. It keeps the game basically new and vibrant. It's really, really cool. Look at the designs of this Mega Craft in the background. I mean, that is so impressive that um, the team can do this. It's such a good-looking game, guys. Super impressed. Look at this. You can actually see the eyes of the Mega Craft, which is super, super cool. Obviously, got the gunboat there. It's cool how it moves and it goes under the water and comes back up. Um, anyway, guys, look at this. We're burning through this. And look at our gumbo energy at the moment. We're in 200-odd. and um, Hopefully, none of these mines actually kill my troops. That would be a bummer. We've actually got the medics killing the guys up, which is pretty good. Um, might need to use a flare to gumbo energy for a flare. We're probably going to lose a medic here. Yeah, we're going to lose a medic. Um, anyway, I might have to reflare back. Yes or no? Will I need to reflare back? I probably won't. I mean, I'm on 300 and... Oh my goodness, look at the gunboat energy, guys. It's crazy. Oh, we could probably do it easier on other maps as well. Because there still wasn't that much stuff on this map. So, this is this record. 
Can you guys, obviously you guys will be able to beat it because it's super, super easy, especially on the Mega Crab when it's these early stages like level 8, which is pretty easy. And look at that, 347 gunboat energy on the Mega Crab stage 8. That's pretty impressive, guys. So, that is a lot. I wonder if I can just smoke now. Smoke, 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 smoke. I wanted to use it all. I wanted to use the gunboat energy. What was I thinking? I should have used it. Oh my goodness. What does stage 9 look like? Um, we'll do stage 9 and see what this one's like. Um, ooh, let's see. Uh, probably not the best, but we'll just go in straight away anyway. We'll just go straight in from this side. I was actually trying to deploy my troops here, guys, which is not very good. But this is so cool how Dr. T... Look at this. It's the big drill. It's got the big claw. I mean, look at that. That is really good-looking graphics, guys. So... Walking through this, probably going to be laying some critters now, taking them boxes out there, laying a critter behind there, and then laying our critters in between to distract. And we'll probably just work our way through this super good, nicely. These critters here will burn through the mortars down the right hand side. I mean, I'm gaining hundreds of gunboat energy anyway without doing anything. So. Yeah, we're just walking through these. These critters are destroying all the defenses. We're going to have about 200 gunboat energy. I'm going to unleash an absolute monster barrage on this. Here we go. This will probably lag. There's a monster barrage on the base. And this is going to drop. There we go. The base drops. Huge amount of barrages. Chuck two safety smokes in there. It didn't deploy though. Um, yeah, that's pretty good. We actually got some gumbo, uh, not gumbo, we actually got some uh, health there from that, so that's pretty good. So that's us on to stage 10. We'll do stage 10, we'll end the video here. I mean, we've got a hell of a lot to to basically, to basically see here. So we'll just run straight in. I'm going to just completely go straight for the base. Um, trying anything that can speed this thing up. Obviously, lay a critter, lay an artillery in there. Um, just to get some things destroyed and um, burning through this nicely gonna be doing that there and one I don't want to barrage this I'm going to lay two critter boxes in there to distract them to this should burst the next critter boxes sending huge amount of critters inside the base there gonna say another critter in there look at these critters are crazy oh this is so fun guys this is this is basically chaos at the moment, super super fun to play, and um, we're just going to be artillery finishing this. Bam 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 bang. Look at that. Bam bam bang, and that is it over. So that's all first sp stage ten, all ten stages complete of the brand new version three of the Mega Crab. And hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please subscribe for more Beach videos, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.